Native Americans have been in this country since 1800s, and yet they continue to be invisible. They continue to be undercounted, no count, misrepresented. And the reality is it is time that we have a box that speaks to who we are as a community. beginning of COVID, the lack of accurate data information about our community really impacted with low funding, impacted without any, any information of the impact it had on our communities, how many were infected, how many took the shots, how many did not take the shots, where did they reside, information and data that could really help us to better serve our community, right? And to lessen the loss of lives or the loss of health. There isn't one, one issue that's out there that we have any data or any information. How do you build a program and sorry, this is for a community, but doesn't exist. The need is there, but it was a hard battle to get to that money, right? Funders will always come back. What's the data on women in domestic violence? What's the data on chronic diseases that your community is, you know, suffers from? What's the data on the sexual abuse of your community? What's the data? on the children who are pulled out of their home, you know, by the Department of Children and Family Services, yet don't come back in the allotted of time by law within two years because the language is a barrier, the culture is a barrier, the fear of not understanding the community is a barrier, right? So all of these issues were enmeshed for the over 21 years that we've established Arab American Family Services. Not having accurate data is detrimental to our community's health, well-being, and being part of the American fabric. Data is, uh, speaks to our community. We don't have statistics on diabetes, mental health, um, drugs, you know? So again, why, do sh why should we have to struggle to find this information? Why should we have to only tell stories? We need information numbers to back those stories up. And that's what having Amina and a census will do for us. It's about time that we finally feel like we're gonna be part of the American fabric in totality with an identity.